helps a lot. That's why we go so hard. That's why we train so hard, you know. At the end of the game, Ohio State is Ohio State, and we want to win every single game. But that game is different, and it's different because of the rivalry. It's different because of the tradition that was left way before – I was even thinking about football and it happened way before, like way after I'm done playing football. And it's just a tradition and that we hold a, we hold ourselves to and we respect it and we respect it by doing those summer workouts, doing those winter workouts and giving it all that game because it is, it is different. What's the mindset like when you do or like this morning or any other day where you're doing that? How'd you find out about this morning? So I now play, I'll play with you. <laughs> Uh-huh. It helps a lot, you know. When when you train so hard for something for so long, and then the day is finally there to let it all loose, you're ready, you're prepared, you put in the work constantly, nonstop. So now it's just payday. Let's go out. Let's have some fun, and not only have some fun, but realize why. You did all those push-ups, all those sit-ups, all those runs. Is for them. Of course. Oh yeah. Well, at the end of the day, we hate them, and they hate us, and that's just the way it is. I mean, when you have a punching bag in front of you with the letters M in front of you and you're punching it and you're punching it because you're tired and you're punching it because your coach keeps telling you to punch it. It's such a mindset in you that when you see that it's switch, it changes you. You're different. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Man, I was just talking about this with my dad yesterday. Um, means a lot. You know, I don't, I don't take any of this for granted at all. I'm extremely blessed and extremely humbled for this experience because I know not everybody gets to do this. And I just want to make sure I represent The Ohio State University in the best way possible. Just because I am that hometown kid that grew up here. And now I'm here in Chicago representing that university that I love so much. And I'm going to keep doing a great job of doing that. Yeah, of course. <laughs> uh, you know, Maryland's a tough opponent. They're a great program. They have a lot of talent, a lot of great players. So we just had to bring our A game. And when it came down to the final seconds, I mean, I had full confidence and trust in my teammates that they were going to make the play and we were going to stop them and we were going to win. Were you on the field for the final play? Yes, I was. I remember they had just had a long run on my side, a little jet sweep that's been working the whole entire game. Yes. Uh, I was pretty upset about that. Yeah. Jog back down. They're getting ready. Um, they do a play action, and the quarterback rolls out on my side. I'm running toward him. He throws the ball in the end zone. Guy drops it. Game over. I feel like it would have been the same just because it is the team of North. And that's just the way it is. At the end of the day, we we want to beat the team of North as bad as beating anybody. And, yeah, those hurts lost. But losing to them would have probably hurt for forever. Uh, I have the Big Ten ring. So you wouldn't have that ring in Maryland if you heard of that, too. Correct.
um, is just having having those new coaches. You know, with new coaches come new personalities and comes new schemes. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, so with all of that, like we, did you say? What, what did you say? Because we have a we have a chip on our shoulder. You know, we 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 don't have to pay attention to, it, but we hear. We hear the doubters. We hear uh, people talking about Ohio State's defense and talking about the Silver Bullets. And we know that we didn't represent them as well as we should have. And with that chip on our shoulder, will come a different swagger, a different intensity, a different toughness uh, with the defense. And that's why I think you're going to see a different defense than you saw last year. Yeah. Just going hard. I mean, guys – Guys are relentless. Guys have something to prove. Like, people, we don't ever want to hear that talk about the Silver Bullets ever again and or ever let that happen again in Ohio State history because that's not the standard that Ohio State is. Coach Day described you guys as salty because of what happened last salty. year on defense. Is that, a, is that a good description for the way you guys? Definitely a little salt, a little salt on my mouth, you know. A little salty, definitely. Um, yeah, I'm a little salty. <laughs> when Justin Fields transfers in, how do you find out? Is there a team group chat? Is there a Twitter? Is there a buzzer on campus? How do you find that news out? I think I – how do I find out? I think I found out through Twitter. Twitter? Just yeah. some fan side of people tweeting at you, or you're, just, you're scrolling and it pops up? Ah, no, I'm just scrolling and it scrolling pops, up. pops up. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's how I found out. He's a great guy, though. Yeah. <laughs>